where tonight's downpours led to flash flooding in several parts of Hartford. Some drivers even had to be rescued from their cars. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Roger Suzanne is joining us now live. He's on Granby Street where Roger, we understand they had some of the worst flooding tonight. Yeah, they really did, Mark, and it was all because it was absolutely pouring in this area. Fortunately, now the rain has slowed to a drizzle, which has allowed the floodwaters to recede. You can see right now Granby Street is mostly just wet, but earlier tonight, the water was so high that it actually stopped drivers dead in their tracks, and firefighters had to rescue at least six people. I want you to check out this video that was captured really just a little over an hour ago, and you can see Hartford firefighters, they surrounded a small Mazda SUV. That was just moments after they had pulled four people from inside the vehicle. Now the rescues happened here on Granby Street near the intersection of Garfield Street and about 100 yards away on Cornwall Street. First responders also helped out two other drivers who got stuck in the water. Now luckily nobody was injured, but even after police set up roadblocks in this area, some drivers took their chances. They drove right around them. One man we spoke with was smart enough to stop and turn around when he saw the floodwaters. But he says when he arrived home to his neighborhood, he was greeted by chaos really all over the place. Um, homestead right there too, when we were coming, there's three car there sitting in the water, can't move too. But I have a big truck that I could be able to go through. Look you at know? this guy behind you. He's driving right through it. Oh yeah. Some people lucky, some don't. <laughs> but I have a big truck so I'm, I'm able to go through. And back live now here on Granby Street, you heard that gentleman mention that he had a big truck, but even he decided once he came up to the floodwaters that he was going to turn around, so he definitely made a smart choice. But that gentleman told me later, once he got to his home, his basement was completely flooded out. So obviously the flash flooding is gone, but some of the uh, results are still in homeowners' homes right now, so still a lot of cleanup possibly here in Hartford. Reporting live in Hartford on Granby Street, I'm Roger Suzanne in Channel 3 Eyewitness News.